Hey guys, Ryan King here, and I'm the keyboard instructor for WorshipArtistry.com. In today's YouTube lesson, we're going to take a look at the song God of This City by Chris Tomlin. Specifically, we're going to look at the intro. Now, we're only going to look at the intro, so if you want to see the entire lesson, you need to click the link and head over to Worship Artistry, where you can sign up for an account for less than 10 bucks a month, and it's totally worth it. But just in case you want to check out a YouTube video, this is for you. This song basically has two intros to it, and the first intro we're going to fade in with that pad. So we need to latch the pad. Make sure you're using it if you're uh, if you're using Omnisphere like I'm doing here. You're going to latch that. Make sure it's programmed all the way up to that high D, and we'll just strike that D without the piano engaged. And so we'll go ahead and strike it. And now that's starting to sound. And then we have our first intro that we'll play, and it looks like this. One, two. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, and off. So you can see how that pad really adds a lot during this section, very ambient, kind of ethereal sounding, and it's very kind of mysterious sounding as well. And so as far as what we're playing after we strike that, it's fairly easy. We're just doing B minor, D, G2, and then we change up. We play B minor with the E to F sharp, D6, back down to the F sharp, and then G2, and you hold that out. Now after that we go into our second intro and this intro that we're going to play here is the main melody that you'll hear a couple of times throughout the song and it's a little syncopated, we've got a nice melody line, we kind of diamond our chord in our left hand and then we have a little bit of syncopation but overall it's not too hard and it looks like this. One, two, three, four, one and two and a three and four and one, two, three, four, one and two and a three and a four and a one, two, three, four. So not too difficult. The main thing you just want to do is break it down into each hand. So to start off with in our right hand, we start off on the D. We're just basically playing eighth notes. We're playing one and two and a three and a four and a one, two, three, repeat. One and two and a three and four and one, two, three in our left hand, we just diamond our B minor chord, two, three, and a four, and G, two, three, again, B, two, A, three, and one, two, three, both hands, one, and two, and a three, and a four, and a one, two, three, repeat, and one, and two, and a three, and a four, and a one, two, three, and four, and off. And that's our second intro. Again, it's not too terribly difficult. You've just got your eighth, eighth notes in your right hand. You're basically just diamonding your chords with the exception of the second chord where you'll diamond it. And then you have that little um, kind of syncopated E there before moving down to your G chord. Now be sure to take a look at your sheet music down below, work through the loop video a few times, and let's move on to the next part of the lesson.